So here's a secret. Some brands of alkalinity increaser have just one active ingredient, and that's sodium bicarbonate. Well, guess what? Sodium bicarbonate is baking soda. Baking soda raises alkalinity levels in your pool, and it can be less expensive than alkalinity increaser at the store. The key is knowing how much to add to your pool and when. Check it out. So first, how do you know if you need to increase your alkalinity? You'll want to test your pool water daily. Your alkalinity levels should be between 100 and 150 ppm or parts per million. And your alkalinity affects your pH, which should be between 7.4 and 7.6, with 7.5 being ideal. So how much baking soda should you add? Well, as a general rule of thumb, use one and a half pounds of baking soda for 10,000 gallons of water. This should raise the alkalinity about 10 parts per million ppm. And if you're not sure how much your pool holds, check out our pool calculator over at swimuniversity.com. Now, once you know your pool's volume and you've measured out the appropriate amount of baking soda, don't go adding it all at once. Remember that alkalinity affects pH. If you adjust the alkalinity too much in either direction, it can affect the pH as well. And then you'll have two problems to solve. So start by adding just a half or three quarters of the baking soda that you've measured out. Rather than just dumping it all into the pool in one spot, make sure that you distribute it in wide arcs across your entire pool. This is called broadcasting the chemical. Be sure to wear protective gear like goggles and gloves, and it's best not to do this on a windy day. I can tell you that an eyeful of baking soda does not feel good. Let the baking soda circulate and dissolve for at least six hours and keep the filtration system running during that time. Then test both the alkalinity and your pH levels. If the levels are still off, you want to repeat the process. And if they're where they should be, well, congratulations. You've saved yourself some money taking care of your pool. If you're looking for an easy to follow tutorial that'll answer all your pool questions, go check out our pool care handbook and video course. You'll get over 30 in-depth video lessons and a step-by-step -step downloadable guide covering everything you need to know about pool maintenance. It's packed with money-saving tips so you can save money and time keeping your swimming pool clean. This is the ultimate manual for every type of pool, including in-ground, above-ground, and in-text blow-up pools. The best part is we always keep it up to date, so once you buy it, you have access to the latest and greatest version for life. So because you're watching this video, you can go to swimuniversity.com slash pool and use the promo code video. If there's a pool care topic you'd like us to cover in a future video, please leave a comment to let us know and hit the like button below if you found this video helpful. If you want to learn more about pool maintenance and troubleshooting, subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one and check out the pool care handbook and video course at swimuniversity.com slash pool. Don't forget to enter the promo code video to get 10% off. That's it. Thanks again and happy swimming.